The Bella Vista RV family truly cares about you and your home away from home. We carry and service a vast selection of top quality trailers and motorhomes that will fit every lifestyle and every budget. Visit us online to see Bruno's ever popular RV walkthrough video. Ceramic tiles throughout. We're 10 minutes north of Barrie on Highway 11. Hi, it's Bruno from Bella Vista RV. Today we're going to take a look at a 2020 Crossroads Zinger 290 KB. This has been a very popular floor plan and for 2020 we have some new updates and changes. So let's take a look outside at this overall unit. Now the 29 KB is approximately 34 feet overall, bumper to bumper. It's going to weigh in at about 6,820 pounds and is going to have a load capacity of 2,810 pounds. So if this is your first video you're watching, uh, uh, those for those who have watched a pre sorry I was a little tongue-tied there for a second for those that have watched our videos previously I talk about load capacity being very important not only do you want to know the dry weight to find out the proper towing vehicle and if this can be towed with a vehicle you already own you want to look at the load capacity to understand what sort of frame is your trailer built on what are the size of the axles and are you going to be pushing those to their maximum limits based on how you're going to tow and where you're going to go? So 2,800 pounds is a lot of load. A lot of consumers only need 800 to 1,000, maybe 1,200 pounds for a longer trip. The nice thing with a big load capacity is that you're not pushing your axles, your suspension and the framework to its limits you're going to have lots of capacity and that's always a plus. So let's take a look at some of the great features of this 2020 Zinger. Up front you're going to notice a flat panel aluminum gives it much more the look of a fiberglass. You're also going to notice the black area here which is our stone guard is nice and tall. It really comes up tall. That will just keep the front protected. We have a power tongue jack up front which is standard. Our two propane tanks. We even have a solar panel plug-in. Now in 2020 Zinger made the power tongue jack and front and, sta front and rear stabilizer jacks power all is standard. So when we look underneath you'll notice the power stabilizers there. Now a great feature of the Zinger is their nice large storage compartments. You'll notice it's big, clean, straight through, no wires, no plumbing that you're dealing with. As we make our way further back, look at the size of this awning compared to the entire size of the trailer covers a majority of the trailer. We have a nice, beautiful LED light strip up there. Now, in 2020, we also have the Sure Steps here. Um, by step above, really sturdy. They fold right in the door. You know, just a great step overall when you go up and down. You're going to notice that they're solid. The bottom legs are length adjustable in case you have some uneven ground. Now for you pet lovers, in 2020 they've added a dog leash holder right here. The Zinger comes with a nice big large grab handle, look how wide that is. And this does have an extreme weather package, which means our underbelly is sealed and when the furnace runs, it's actually pumping some air down in there. Now as we move our way back, you're going to notice an outside TV hookup here. Some power outlets, not only for the TV, but for other gear. We have outside speakers and that black rectangular area that you're seeing, that's actually our vent for our stove. Then over here, we have a black tank flush. So in the black tank, there's a sprayer. Hook up your hose here, it sprays out that tank. Just make sure you've got your dump valves open or you're gonna get some surprises. Outside shower, and then we, of course, we have our mini fridge and our outside kitchen. So we have, this will pull out. We have a sink with hot and cold running water and our two burners here for cooking and shelf above. As we come around back, we are prepped with backup camera, so you can actually buy the camera and the screen as a kit, plug and play, and there's our switch 
for our power stabilizers in the back. For 2020, our rims are black steel rims, so they look really, really nice in the black. But really, let's go take a look inside because this is where the big beauty of this unit really, really shines. So as we come in, we have new flooring for 2020. Gives it that, you know, wood, well, wood kind of finish look on it. Uh, we also have a great sofa here with drop down cup holders in the center. And what I really love is it's a futon sofa. Now you can do two things. You can flip the sofa up this way to gain access to the storage, or you can flip the front of the couch up to gain access to the storage. So two ways to do that, depending on, did you put games and toys under there for the kids or have you put linens? Nice big U-shaped dinette with a single leg. So in the past with the double legs, a few customers have said, you know, it's a little tough to get in and out. Now we have the single leg. When you look underneath, nice and easy to get around. Fabric shades are new for 2020. You'll notice nice shades, super large windows. And in 2020, we have gone over to the lighter woods. Very modern looking, very elegant. And we've also, we've retained the residential faucet that pulls down, but we've gone to a nice large stainless steel sink, but really the key is the sink cover. So if you're not washing, you need the extra prep space, look at that and it just integrates beautifully. We're also going to see more glass inserts for 2020 in our cabinetry. What has remained standard from the previous year, our Bluetooth soundbar that connects to our outside speakers. We also have that beautiful fireplace that throws heat. Um, as you've heard me talk in other videos, our main command center right here at the door. So if we want, we can turn around, turn off our, our main lights. So one flick of a switch when you come in, your main lights turn on and off. And you could sit at night if you're watching some TV or just wanted to chill with the blue LED lights. And then we have them on this side of our kitchen countertop as well. Now let's take a look at our front bedroom and then we'll make our way through the unit. So as normal, residential queen size bed. Zinger's been doing that for several years. Really nice feature, especially if you're really tall. You're gonna feel much more comfortable and still look at the amount of space all the way around the bed. Now, windows that open. That's, that um, blind is down right now, but there is a screen behind that and that emergency window can be opened up so you can vent. On our passenger side, we also have a window that opens with a screen because we're noticing that a number of our competitors are actually just putting a fixed window here so you can't get ventilation. On Zinger you can get cross ventilation. Also nice little features. Light switch. This is a number of the rooms instead of having to go up and actually push on each of the lights you can turn a majority of lights on and off with light switches. We do have reading lights underneath. Those you're gonna turn on one light at a time, giving you that flexibility. Nice big wardrobes with the large shelf across the top. And then for 2020, they've gone with the, the wood look, the antique wood look on the back wall. That has replaced the shiplap look from 2019. Now what I do like is that we have a power and a USB, so a 110 and a USB plug there power plug on that side and then let's take a look under the bed. So as we lift this up, oops, sorry I'm trying to do this one-handed here. So as we lift that up, you're going to notice a nice shock here, big deep storage as well for the bed itself. And yes, I leave those things in the video because I do occasionally make a mistake trying to do it one-handed, just to give you an idea. Now we talked about the futon style sofa next to the large U-shaped dinette here. We do have a USB plug. And then on this side, you're gonna see we've 
They've upgraded the oven. We have a glass door, glass top for prep, even some backlighting LED on the knobs, which is just a nice little feature. Microwave above, nice little focused backsplash area to give it more of a residential feel. Now in this unit, we have the upgraded gas electric fridge. Standard will be a 12 volt fridge with a stainless steel front. Now we have a really nice pantry here, nice and deep. Let's take a look at the washroom before we go to the back room because there's a little surprise back there this year. So porcelain toilets have remained standard for 2020. Good storage space, good shelving. Uh, plug right here to be able to plug in hair dryers, shavers, etc. Our medicine cabinet. Hi, everyone. Nice big deep mini tub if you have little kids, great for bathing. Full surround with our skylight and vent above. Now, for 2020, we have a surprise back here. For 2019, you would have walked in and you would have noticed that this would have been four bunks with a convertible dinette. For 2020, they've changed it. We have two bunks on this side, rated for 300 pounds, plus a shorter bunk if you have a smaller child to go across or a taller person wants to sleep across. When you'll notice, we've got lights in multiple locations. Now the main lights turn on with a light switch right behind me. USBs and power plugs up top, USB and power plug down here power plug over there, but now we have that great futon style sofa with the fold down armrest and cup holders. And underneath, yes, we have a trundle bed. So we can pull out the mattress. We've got this extra mattress if you needed the space or the kids want to sit on the floor and play. Then I'm going to turn around, close that door because on a rainy day, I could put the TV on top of the cabinets that give extra storage space for clothes. And we could sit here and, and game, watch a movie, or we'd just chill, which is really nice. So this could also be used for adults to sit back here. We've got a nice large window on this side to let in lots of natural light. And something that people have asked for in the past, a nice ladder to get up to the top bunks. So it's here as well, and another window. Um, now in 2020, what I also like that they've done, when you look at the ceiling, you're gonna just notice the little cross accents, which is nice, just breaks it up. Now we have a fully ducted air conditioning, and then our heat is fully ducted through the floor. This does have that extreme weather package, as I mentioned earlier. So we have a fully ducted uh, heat system. We have a duct that runs down to our holding tanks and a sealed underbelly, so it stays a little warmer in the cooler weather. So if you're in the market, you're looking for a great family unit. This 290 has always been a big seller for us here. Great layout. You know, they've just taken it to a new level for 2020, and that way you've got your choice, right? Um, Great little layout in the back with that separate room, just changing it up a little bit, gives you a little more flexibility. The new lighter woods, the LED accents. So if you're in the market for a great unit that caters to a family really well, caters to a couple that wants to take their grandkids or some friends along, the 290's a nice option to have. Very well priced here at Bella Vista, as well as light enough to be towed by a half ton pickup and still have lots of towing flexibility so you're not maxing your truck out. Great suspension underneath the trailer and, and load capacity and great features across the board. Now the only thing we didn't talk about since I'm talking about quality and the finishings is our construction. So this is a wood frame trailer. Our walls are framed every 16 inches or less so there's a lot of studying, a lot of support in the walls. Same as, excuse me, same as our floors 
and our ceiling. We also use a TPO roof, which is a thermopolyethylene. Try to say that four or five times in a row. It'll tongue tie you. Thermopolyethylene, or TPO as it's known, is a product that is much more durable than EPDM or a rubber roof. A lot less maintenance is required, so it's gonna save you time during your camping season. Much more durable. Uh, been used in the motorhome side of the industry for a number of years. Just a great product overall, delivering a lot more value in this Zinger. Anyways, this is Bruno from Bella Vista. If you like the video, please click the like button. We'd really appreciate that. Feel free to post your comments below. We always read the comments and I try to reply when possible. Um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. We'd love to have you as a subscriber in the little bell just below. If you click on that, that'll actually send you notifications of when new videos are posted on the great Zinger product by Crossroads as well as the other products available here at Bella Vista RV. For more information on this 2020 Crossroads Zinger 290KB, visit our website at RV. Com. Thank you very much. I'm going to wish you and your family a happy and safe camping season.